We are Tal and Mads, a nurse and a teacher who fell in love while traveling the world together. We built a camper van to take us and our dog Bowie to some pretty spectacular places. Van life has proven to be a wild roller coaster, and this time around, it's no exception. We are embarking on what we're sure will be the biggest adventure yet. We are driving all the way from Toronto to Alaska and all the way back. Last week, we took you through some of the major upgrades we made to the van. This week, we finally move back in and get on the road. Goodbye, my favorite roommate. And favorite. <laughs> you just said bye to us, no tears. Says bye to Bowie, is bawling your eyes. Look at this face. It's just a world traveler. <laughs> All right, we're officially moved back into the van. We are still in the city. Tal just ran into the grocery store to pick up a few last minute things. So I don't think it has really hit me yet that we are leaving. And then we're heading over to the mechanic to get that last part replaced. And then we're heading for the border, which is when I think it will actually hit me that we are back in here and on the road. Uh, drive safe. Thank you. Don't rush your time. No. Yeah. Drive the way I, I show you. As you can see, he really is just the best. And like, I'm not even saying this to promote him because the man does not need to be any busier than he already is, but just love having people on our side. All right, let's get this show on the road. What's happening? Is it really, really happening? It's happening, let's do it! Woo! All right, All right. next stop, Who knows? Alaska! <laughs> okay, get in your seat. Excuse me, he took my spot. Go to your bed. Yeah, good boy! <laughs> what you? Ready for my... And then, juggle. Wow. All right. Hit it. I can see us coming, lightning striking down. They're on our tails, hot on the trail. On the cover, you won't hear a sound. Wildfire, you can't catch us now. Running, 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 yeah. We're out here all the run. Running, 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 yeah. Watch how cute we come. There's a door in the back, too. There is in the back, yeah. You just want to hold it there. Okay. Sure. I have to come open it for you. Big tough guy. You're my tough guy. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's a good boy. Yeah. I know. <laughs> yeah. I know, you're doing a good job. <laughs> you're all set. Thanks Thank so much. Have a good night. Have a good night. You too. Success! We are in the USA. <laughs> Bowie is awake. <laughs> All right, we are parked in the one and only Walmart parking lot. I guess it's not the one and only. There's probably a billion of them, but it feels right that the first night we ever spent in the van was at a Walmart. And so we're right back here. One last note. We do not have a water heater in this van. And this never bothered us because we were in Mexico but the water is freezing right now. So trying to wash your face is basically like taking a polar dip. Oh, and now I'm awake. Cookie night bowl. Oh, we cup cuddle. That was one of the quietest nights we've had in the van. <laughs> other than the loud rap music that was playing for hours. Oh wow, I didn't hear that at all. <laughs> okay, time to make coffee in the van for the first time. I'm so excited to try it. I mean, it's nothing special. It's just a drip coffee maker, but it's just very homey, not very camper vanny. So it makes me feel very fancy. Filled up some gas, making a little breakfast pit stop on a little patch of grass outside of a hotel. But he's very happy about it. The weather is exercise break. Yeah. Another appliance we definitely couldn't use before. Oh yeah. So smoothie time. It's smoothie time. <laughs> I literally just said that. <laughs> smoothie in the van. 
Smoothie dance, smoothie dance, smoothie dance. Smoothie dance. dance. Real quick, I want to say a thank you to this week's sponsor. Mantis Sleep is more than just a really, 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 really ridiculously, ridiculously good-looking good sleep mask. They are on a mission to give you the energy to create your best life through the one thing that I can guarantee you you are not getting enough of. Sleep. And I'm not only talking about getting good quality sleep at night. How many of you have felt a complete energy crash after lunchtime, driving you to get another cup of coffee to try and be a little bit productive on the second half of your workday? Well, Mantis Sleep believes that naps beat coffee, hands down. They are proudly pro-nap and fighting the good fight against hustle culture. Naps give you energy, focus, strength, and clarity that you don't get when you grind throughout the afternoon. And there is no doubt about it. When I wear my Mantis Sleep mask, I get good quality, uninterrupted sleep. We've been wearing it in the van, on planes, and anywhere in between. We have the Mantis Sleep Mask Pro. It features true 100% blackout for a deeper sleep. It has advanced materials for really good breathability, and these cups offer zero pressure on your eyelids and eyelashes. Click the link in the description and use our code TAL and MADS and you'll get your discount today. And now, if you excuse me. So, the last time we drove through the United States, one of my favorite parts of the drive was stopping at the many different truck stops. They always had so much more than you thought they would. When I stumbled across the Iowa 80 and read that it was the world's largest truck stop, I knew we absolutely had to stop there. Just from the website, it looks basically like a theme park, so I can't wait to see what they have. Hey man, are you going? Hey, you over there. You too. Are you going? Where do you even enter? Like, it's so big. There's so many entrances. There's people with like lanyards coming off of buses and I can't tell if they've come here on a tour of the truck stop or if they're just stopping. No, this is obviously route. a stop on route. I, I don't thought know. that this was the destination. There's a museum here. There's food. Like, this is a destination to me. All right, Iowa. So far, you've officially made me take my socks off. That means you get an A+. Plus. Oh, yeah. Tell me you're Canadian without telling me you're Canadian. From that gas station to this. My dad was an immigrant to Canada when he was probably 20 years old, I want to say. And his first job when he came to Canada was a truck driver. So I just love looking around and imagining my dad, how excited he was. He always talks about how beautiful the landscape was in Canada. Meanwhile, he was driving, you know, just flat ground and he just really loved the greenery. And I just love thinking about that when I see these truck drivers. It's so loud. The combination of all of their engines is, is loud. <laughs> I don't know what it is about this place, but I'm like immensely excited. Let's see what they got. Why do I always put my hand right to the blah, 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 over here? Wow, it's huge in here. It's like a grocery store. I'm here for the snacks. This place is crazy. I feel like it's so big up here that you could get lost. Housekeeping. Wow. Welcome to the gym. Get it. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> you just literally levitated up there. Oh my God. They took the top off so you did <laughs> Come on, everyone cheer on. Right this way to the movie theater. <laughs> she lives here now. I want to have a party here, invite all my friends, all of you guys. Welcome to the living room, fireplace and everything. Thank you. There is even an arcade. Woo! Look at all of the drink fridges here. I don't know how you ever pick just one. I guess you don't, that's the idea. Okay, I mean, I wanted to spend like a <laughs> week there. Work out, watch movies, do your laundry, play games, but the weather is so outstandingly gorgeous in Iowa right now that we're trying to find a spot where we can kind of just take a break from driving, run around with Bowie, get some exercise in, and enjoy. So let's go. I say that a lot. Yeah. <laughs> so? So. Okay. Okay. We just pulled up to the spot and we couldn't have a nicer sunset. It feels so good to be at our first camp spot where we can actually open our doors and have some space. This is why we do it and oh, uh, the excitement is really starting to kick in now. It's starting to feel like a home in here. Tal's watching TV and it's nice and cozy. Good night. Good morning. <laughs> 
this up so well. Okay, I think we may have told you this before, but because Bowie is a rescue, he took a very long time to understand toys. In fact, he still doesn't understand toys. He only likes this one toy. So every time he plays with it, it's extra special. He only likes this toy because it's basically like a little towel, which is what he had before, only towels. So we bought him a new blanket for the trip and he hasn't been really taking to it because we've been driving and he hasn't had a chance to really get to know her. And now I feel like I'm watching their first date and it's, it's going swimmingly. It's the first time we're plugging in through shore power. Let's see if we're charging. 74.3 amps. Wow. so sunny and beautiful here right now it's so windy so we have decided to get out here and continue on our way and now Talia is driving away from you I have to go catch her what is she doing this campground has been good to us on to the next we just pulled into our Walmart parking lot to make some dinner and then get back on the road but I realized we do not have a can opener so my pasta sauce has turned into a fresh tomato sauce. <laughs> All right, success. Some fake meat, spinach, tomato, onion, mushroom, pasta. Well, I'll wait for the thumbs up until I have my uh, taste test too. So good. Is it okay? Mm -hmm. It's okay without the oh, canned tomatoes? It's amazing. It's so good. Just woke up early, giving Bowie a little walk. Stretch those little fluffy legs. Honestly, we've been doing a ton of driving, which we did last year as well. We drove across the country all the way to Mexico. But the journey to Alaska is just feeling very daunting right now. But every time I think about it, I just imagine being there. And, and I think nothing worth anything comes easy. So we're just going to do it. We're gonna go for it, full on. And I hope you'll come with us. We have something to show you that we are so excited about. Howdy y'all. Woo! We have officially passed the halfway point. Was I meant to be a cowgirl? 